Howdy cowdies. It's that time of the week again. Weekly walkabout. Got some more cool stuff at the collector this week. Got some nice jewellery. I really like this little silver marcasite sort of dress clip. Nice little Australian made summer gold specialty fruit delicacy tin. Our Victorian toothpaste pot. A little Jacko boot polish is cute. A little carriage clocks are really nice over the back. Some gold jewellery. Tate's throat pastels. Cool little tin. Fantastic little brass sort of articulated little sort of bird which sort of runs off steam. Little steam powered thing. Great little thing. A little clockwork toy over the back as well. I think it's clockwork. Uh, a little, I think it's midwinter figure. It's a bit unusual. Nice sort of mid-century modern silver jewellery brooches. Cards, models of yesteryear. A fantastic collection of gramophone needle tins. That's a bloody big lot. And here's a nice little money bank. It's got the key to go with it. A little D-shaped sort of display cam that's nice, painted white, with a couple of butterfly specimens in it. Right down the bottoms there, pretty cool. It's got the whole, like, branch and the sort of... Um, Sort of like the cycle of life of a butterfly. It's kind of cool. Yes, we've got a little piano stool. And I think there's some golf stuff inside there as a bonus. Nice little lot of sort of tins, nursery tins, money backs, boxes, watches, weights, more tins. Nice little bits of sort of train and wooden stuff, snake bite kits, blokey gear, heaps of sort of Essendon stuff, cufflinks, watches, pens. There you go, a couple of big boxes of sort of Essendon. Um, clothing, apparel and all sorts of stuff, punch magazines, cricket gear, more tins, workman's lantern, a little lot of kitchen alley, there's some cool clothes and stuff, long sleeve woolen Essendon jumpers, coats, nice Burberry's trench coat here with the label, Essendon gear, CDs, mixed lots, three big boxes more of sort of Essendon apparel and other sort of merchandise and gear. A lot of stuff, nice little box of china, Royal Albert all over floral, Mimco bag with some other ladies' accessories inside, books, record sheet music, there's a chair, chair in there, <laughs> box of CDs, box of bottles, box of tins, and there's some interesting stuff in amongst there as well, we've got pretty china and glassware and stuff, a couple of boxes of ephemera, some interesting gear in amongst here. National fitness. Expectancy. What to expect from expectancy. Train books. Cole's funny picture books. Good box lot of sort of mixed pubalalia and blokey gear. How's that for a big box of all the copper and brass sort of wall charges and frisbees? Some nice light fittings down underneath. Big modern sort of sideboard. First we've got little bench there. It's a kind of little cutie. Traffic lights. Keyboards, toys and stuff. What else have we got? Outdoor gear, Doc Martens boots, records, pasta makers, slot car racing set, a big clock and some other sort of toys and gear. Kind of like this little wooden lamp. It's actually kind of cute. Um, boxes of mixed items, some cool old sort of e ephemera, dressmaking books, some nice little lots of sort of lingerie and stuff. Uh... Art and paintings, Jim Croft oil painting there, heaps of spoons, some Leeds soccer jerseys, books and tins, footy gear, three boxes of footy gear. I like this little pot cabinet, it's a bit of a cutie, a little Edwardian one. Camper wood trunk, a nice big box of stamps. This is a nice big group lot with the bench and all the sort of tools and stuff underneath it as well. Group lot of sort of retro and other lighting, Bendigo and Hoffman pottery. That's a lot of Australiana stuff. Some cool bits in amongst there. All the 70s sort of kitsch wall hangs. China, tins, glass. Pubinalia. The Last Laugh Theatre restaurant poster. Cool big train light. A little colour lithograph there of a thoroughbred. Looks to be a framed, signed footy jumper from Footscray. 1999 team. Nice little British school etching. Sydney R. Jones. This is a nice Arnold Jarvis watercolour. Really nice example. A nice little Hannah Swain etchings. Quite modern, British artist. But they're fantastic. Good fun. Nice colours. What else have we got? 
little contemporary piece here, New Zealand thing, and nice little colour lithograph there as well of the new Westminster Bridge. All right, what else have I got, guys? Little groups of mixed mix items, including the smallest bottle of thistle scotch whiskey you'll ever see. Wade and other ceramics, tins, nice art deco planter made by Forrester. Little biscuit tins of cutie up the top there. Costume jewellery, inkwells, cutlery, Australian pottery, tins. More tins. Little cigarette stuff, little Kent is a little radio. Dolls and some bunnikins. More tins. It's a great lot. These are all old pub glasses. Uh, Red Bluff Hotel in Sandringham. Yeah, some cool things here. They've all got their names etched into them. Palace Hotel. Nice little group lot. More tins. Pubanalia. Butterfly specimens. Nice Art Deco tin over the back of the Snow Girl. They're nice as well. Little Aussie Tobacco. Temple Bar and the Capstan. Another nice lot of sort of mixed sort of tins and other things down the bottom there. Essendon sort of medals and badges and things. Kitchen Alia. That's Toby having a bark in the background. Escape from Burma. Pretty cool poster. Oil lamp. More signs. Nice little paintings here by Lily Day. Nice little things they are actually. A couple of nice Sam Booker and Irish Mist decanters. Royal Dalton. More tins. Pubanalia. Little military satchels. Cute. Pascal's. Nice Pascal's three or three tier tin. Little Clock's cute. Some Franklin Mint and other china. These are nice, the old sort of coat racks. Retro sort of wooden items. Tins. A lot of sort of ladies' products. Sort of retro ceramics and stuff. I like the little shark hole sign, little metal shark hole sign. We've put it with a little tankard of rugby players. Six million dollar man. Another nice tin. Cecil Alden color lithos. Then a couple of cabinets, guys. Some nice good lot of Dalton down the bottom there. More butterfly specimens. Shorter and Son. Tunstall. He's nice. The whole state toffee tin, which you can convert into a inkwell. Some Beck pottery. Phyllis Dunn pottery. I like this little Romeo um, bride cake box. Whitcomb and Tom's Limited, Christchurch, Wellington, Dunedin. It's got a nice little label on the pack on the top. Um, addressed to somebody in Elstonwick. Glen Huntley Road. Adderley, China. Nice big willow willow pattern. Canister set. Tins, Claris Cliff, another Deco China. Robin Hood tins a ripper. Robert Teapot, which is there. Uh, it's a little bit worn out, but we'll put some tins with it. He's nice, the big sugar canister. Nice Art Deco light fitting. It's an old WEG poster there. Kazali Classic sort of prints. More nice butterflies. I think it's a big um, folded up poster down there of an ME 110. Interesting little Aboriginal piece there done on a bit of stone. Um, Balik, kind of like the Deco tins. Royal Albert, Staffordshire flatback, scales. A pair of boxing trunks signed by Lionel Rose. More Balik, nice little clock. Narataki, little Ron Willis oil painting over the backs of Ripper. One of Pro Hearts cronies, one of the Brushmen of the Bush. Little pottery. Cooker bar is interesting too. Lovely tins. What else have we got? The little Milne's whiskey jug. Coffee and chicory canister. Little Chapara style figure. She is bronze, but she's not an original one. Pretty cool, the big sort of safe plaque over the back. Edwards & Co. Ensign baking powder tins. A bit different. Nice little pair of orange overlay glass vases. Czechoslovakian sort of Dittmar back. Another reproduction bronze. Sign Lionel Rose boxing glove, and he's about to punch a turkey in the face. A nice little Derbyshire salt and pepper shakers. There you go, this tin's a bit different as well. It's a Lipton's tin. That'll sort of do, guys. I could keep rambling on, you know what I'm like. That'll do for this week, though. Hopefully we see you on Thursday night. It's going to be another good sale.